Okay, uh, just a quick uh, test. Trying to limit the amount of input um, into the ZVS uh, to power the um, the coil, the A coil. Uh, we collect it through the toroid, um, a bifiler winding into a 35 watt um, bulb, 230 volts. Um, what I have here um, is two uh, boosters, DC, DC booster, uh, 2 volts to 20 volts. Um, they're set at 13.29 volts output. Um, the power supply is uh, 2.7 volt DC uh, ultra capacitors. Um, because they have the amperage, um, this is what makes the difference, of course. Uh, before I uh, try to use 3 volts, uh, which works great with uh, the two circuits. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, if I should, uh, if I should want a uh, fan working, a normal 12 volt fan. Um, but we needed the kick. Uh, to get the ZVS uh, going. So as you can see, um, we are able to light, uh, I'll just uh, watch my fingers so we don't uh, get a shock. And as you can see, it's giving, it's not the brightest light, but for 2.7 volts input, um, it's pretty good. Uh, the next step, of course, will be to see if we can put uh, another toroid here and rectify it and back into the caps um, to see if we can loop it this way and to see how much uh, power the caps or how much drain is on this. The last, um, the last experiment, I had a 6 watt. Uh, bulb which was uh, very bright. Uh, it was an LED of course as well um, So that makes a, a big difference if uh, replicating these uh, setups um, Yeah, so Just thought uh, I'd show you what I'm playing with today Any comments, please feel free stay posted